Dan Resnicek from Pacific Northwest Urology, and today I'm going to be talking about a prostate biopsy. A prostate biopsy is usually recommended to determine if you have prostate cancer. It is the only test able to definitively diagnose cancer. The procedure is typically performed in our ambulatory surgery center and takes about 5 to 10 minutes total. Prior to the procedure, your urologist will ask you to stop aspirin, Plavix, or any blood thinners to help prevent excessive bleeding. You will also be given an antibiotic to take to help prevent an infection. Once at the surgery center, we'll change you into a gown and you'll come into one of our procedure rooms. There, the urologist will use a specially designed ultrasound to help identify the prostate as well as give a local anesthetic nerve block to prevent any pain. Generally, 10 to 16 biopsies are performed. The size of the prostate is also measured as well to help with treatment options in the future. After the biopsies are taken, they're sent to a pathologist who will then look at them under the microscope. Generally, it takes between two and seven days to get the results back to tell if there is cancer or not. We'll typically call you with those results and schedule an office visit if needed. Following the procedure, you can expect blood in your urine for several days, in your stool for several days, and your ejaculate for about 10 to 15 ejaculations. Infections are rare, but typically present with fevers or chills. If you have these, this may be a sign of a serious infection, and please call our office or if after hours, go to the emergency department for evaluation. If you have any more questions about a prostate biopsy, please visit our website for more information. Thanks for watching.